This is the July Voices Between You and Me, and I thought I'd read it with you. Maybe a little singing as well. So, summer breeze makes me feel fine, blowing through the jasmine in my mind. Now, you can look at the QR reader on your page and get that song in completion, but the chorus of this Seals and Croft classic uses a summer day as the backdrop for a hardworking individual trying to find clarity in his life. The lyrics state that upon opening the doors to his home, the things that await him include not a care in the world and the arms that reach out to hold me, which offer the individual fulfillment and relaxation from the challenges found in the outside world. While pleasant picture, in today's world, this existence is becoming more difficult. As our business and personal spaces link more fully together, finding refuge within our homes from outside worries can be challenging. Modern marvels such as handhelds, laptops, and tablets are extremely entertaining, informative, and helpful. But they blur the lines between our business and personal spheres. Enabling instant connection globally, we are becoming more inclined to, an answer, to answer important emails, make vital phone calls, and finish critical proposals in the confines of our own home. The home then becomes an extension of our office rather than a completely separate space for renewal and revitalization. So how can we still ensure, even with these worthwhile technologies, that we find the time to escape from this constant connectivity? Turning off or refusing to answer these electronic devices upon entering our homes, while the obvious answer is less and less feasible in today, with today's demands. However, the more we attend to business needs outside of the office, the less attention we pay to essential personal aspects, such as setting time aside to refresh internally, spending time with family and friends, and connecting or concentrating on our physical wellness. Given the outside pressures that step into our personal lives, it is imperative to consciously designate time to unplug in order to safeguard our metaphorical homes. Rabbi Abraham Joshua Heschel, a preeminent Jewish thinker in the 20th century, once explained, the meaning of Shabbat is to celebrate time rather than space. Six days a week we live under the tyranny of things of space. On Shabbat we try to become attuned to the holiness in time. It is a day on which we are called upon to share what is eternal in time, to turn from the results of creation to the mystery of creation, from the world of creation to the creation of the world. His discussion emphasizes the importance of designated time to turn away from worldly distractions in order to focus completely on finding holiness in our personal time. The summer can provide us an opportune time to form lasting Shabbat habits that tune out business worries and uncover moments of holiness. To begin, leave the phone on the counter and take a walk. Read a book, paper, or on a tablet then turn off the internet connection for a designated period. Or choose to open the laptop at home on Saturdays only during specific periods. These simple steps can ensure that our home remains a place of reprieve, comfort, and sacredness so we can continue to find within it the jasmine in our mind. Summer breeze.